and Ophir, and Havilah, and Jabab all these were the sons of Joktan. Genesis 10:29. And Ophir, and Havilah, and Jabab. If several of the sons of Joktan went into India, as the Arabs say, one would be tempted to think that Ophir in India, whither Solomon sent his ships once in three years, had its name from the first of these, see Gil on Genesis 10:26 but as this would be carrying him too far from the rest of his brethren, who appear to have settled in Arabia, some place must be found for him there, and yet there is none in which there is any likeness of the name, unless Koper can be thought to be, a village in the country of the Sinodokalpits, on the Arabian Gulf, as in Ptolemy, or Ogyrus, an island in the same sea, Pliny makes mention of the same with the Organa of Ptolemy, placed by him on the Sashalite Bay, Wherefore Bacart looks out elsewhere for a seat for this offer, or offer, as in the Septuagint version, and finding in a fragment of Eupolemus, preserved by Eusbius, mention made of the island of Arf, which he thinks should be offer, or upper, situated in the Red Sea. Seems willing to have it to be the seat of this man and his posterity, and that it had its name from him, or that their seat was among the Cassanites or Gassendi, the same perhaps with the tribe of Gassan, Offer, and Chazan signifying much the same, even great abundance and treasure Havila, next mentioned, is different from Havila, the son of Cush, Genesis 10:7, and so his country, but it is difficult where to fix him, one would rather think that the Avalite Bay, Emporium, and people should take their name from him than from Obel, Genesis 10:28 but Bakar chooses to place him and his posterity in Jolan, a country in Arabia Felix, in the extreme part of Kassanitis, near the Sabaeans and Jabab, the last of Joktan's sons, was the father of the Jobabites, called by Ptolemy Jobarites, corruptly for Jobabites, as Salmasus and Bakar think, and who are placed by the above geographer near the Satchelites in Arabia Felix, whose country was full of deserts, as Jabab in Arabic signifies, so Bacart observes, as the countries above the Sashalite Bay were, by which these Jobabites are placed. All these were the sons of Joktan. The thirteen before mentioned, all which had their dwelling in Arabia or near it, and which is further described in the following verse.